Hi everyone, this is a painting that I've just done and I'm going to show you how to do it and you'll have tons and tons of fun. It's not hard, it really isn't and once you know how to do it you will create many pictures, space pictures and you can add whatever you want. So just take a good look at that, I've just done that and I'm going to show you how to do it. And if anybody's seen my art um, website, go on there and have a look at the spray painting. The one titled The Spray Painting. Take a look at the pictures I've done. They were done with spray paints and they took some of them less than 10 minutes to do. Unbelievable because of the detail, but it's true. And when I get the right camera, I'm going to get Ray to film me doing a spray picture. I'm going to show you how to do that. This is very similar, but not done with a spray paint. It's done with acrylics. And I'm going to show you how to do it. So it's just a basic space picture. You'll love it. Might take two or three videos. Not bothered. Let's get started. I'm going to go through the materials you're going to need. So I'm just going to pop that there. Just get my paper that I'm going to need. Just ordinary card. Quite thick though because of the paint you're going to put on. I'm going to cut mine. You could do it that size, but I haven't got the room to do it, you, you know, to show you. So I'm just going to do an A5. Okay cut my paper in half this is the piece I'm going to use that's still wet <coughs> and you're going to need different colours of um, acrylic paints you're also going to need because it's not spray paint a little solution and all it is is white acrylic paint and added to that is some water and you need that to splatter about when you're finished just going to wash my brush and the first thing is it, we're going to start on the planets and you know I'll try and recreate that same picture to show you so first of all we're going to, I'm going to do a yellow and red planet so I'm going to take my yellow take my brush I'm using a flat ended brush at the moment get the paint and you know roughly where you're, uh, you want your planets. Just decide where you want them. Go anywhere you want. Not painting circles or anything like that. That'll do for mine. I'll put my lid. Okay. Now, wash my brush. And then take my red acrylic paint. Need a little bit of paper, and all it is is scrunched up paper. Take a bit off, really, really screw it up because that's what's going to give you the pattern. Okay, take my brush again, dip it in the uh, red, quickly go over that, and while that's wet, press on your paper and it leaves you with a pattern I'm just going to show you that like that see when you've done that I'm going to do a big planet pop that on there press it down yep that's going to be that then what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a smaller one and I'm going to have a green planet. Again, take my brush and whatever colour green I'm going to use, I'll use a different green. Like I say, it might go into two or three videos, but uh, keep watching, you'll see. Okay, just dry your brush off a little bit on a cloth. And I'm going to have another planet, round about here. 
a little bigger than that. <coughs> Wash my brush. Dry it off again. I'm going to add a bit of blue. A little bit of blue. Go over that. Take a bit more paper. Scrunch it up. Like that. Lay that on. Peel it off. Beautiful. Look at that. See? Just my bin that. I'm going to take my lid and I'm going to pop that on there. Leave it on there. Don't. Once you've got it on, leave it on. I'm going to have a little blue planet over here. I'm also going to mix a bit of white with it. Wash my brush. Not quite what I want. Take a bit of paper. Pat it off. Don't want that. And I'm going to have a bit of... Because that was a watered down white. I want a thicker white. Take the blue. Keep adding. So I get what I want. Remember what planets are like. They look like they've got streaks across them, don't they? As soon as you get that. <coughs> Oops, got caught up. Just going to dry that off. Then I'm going to take the lid off one of my spray bottles and pop that on there. Not quite where I want it. Pop it on there. I'm going to have another planet. And I think this time we'll go for pink. Why not? And have a pink planet if we want. Oops, wrong brush. Any colour planet you want. And I'm going to put it in this corner. I'm also going to add a bit of red. Yep, yeah, like that. Just uh, pop that back on. I'm going to dry that before I put the lid on. myself caught up. Jesus, how I'd love my own room. <laughs> Just ignore. Right, take my lid. I might do a bigger lid, I think. Let me find a bit of a bigger lid. Because you can do any size lid you want. I'll use one of these. There you go. Just like that. Now we're going to do the bottom bit. And for that, I'm just going to paint it brown. Okay? Right, we're on 8.58 already, but if it goes off, please come back. Please come back and watch this. It's really, really good. And it's something new for you. Just going to do... Add a bit of water to that, because it is acrylic paint, so you can water this down. Yeah, it's going to go off shortly, ladies and gents, so just come back, please. You want one side of it a little bit darker. Like that. Add a bit of water, and we'll water this side down. Just do like a pyramid. That's it. Shaded. Right, it's going to go off, ladies and gents. Please come back and watch the rest. <laughs> 